Hello, I'm Andrew Lizzie, and welcome back to Battle for the Gothic Armada 2. We're playing the Imperial Campaign, and we have a whole load of Tyranids heading for us. A lot of Tyranids. Like, a lot of Tyranids. So, firstly, let's deal with the other stuff. We have Necrons here. We're going to upgrade you. We're just going to allow us to put in the space station and defense platforms. Then we'll head our fleet down here. We could get a extra escort ship in. It's a shame that our Grand Cruiser is going to be pretty badly damaged for this, but we'll probably want to just add an escort just to bulk out the force here. I'd get... There is definitely like a... a, a divide in the comments section. Between... Escorts are terrible, why are you getting escorts? And you should get more escorts. They're useful. My rule of thumb on escorts is... And I think... I think one thing that I found uh, from some of the like the hardcore players who've analysed the stats and stuff is that they've been saying if you look at the amount of firepower that ships have, smaller ships have more firepower for their points. It's just that they die easier, whereas bigger ships have less firepower, but obviously they have more hull and more shield. Uh, this is going to be Laws Luxor. Oh God, what's this going to be? Um, Sophie sets Luxor. Or maybe just Sophie's set. Yeah, that works. Firestorms especially, because that lance at the front, have a decent amount of firepower. But also I get them for grabbing objective points, uh, pinging so that we can see people around us. Very necessary, especially against Eldar. And a number of things like that. Like, they have their uses. They do die often. But also, in this case, it fills up the, the spare space. Instead of getting anything else, I can't. So I have to get an escort or have nothing. And that's the reason that I get an escort quite often uh, in the game. I could send you, but then there's a 20% chance of Chikari raiding here. And I'd rather not. So instead, we'll take this fight. We are pretty good because of our defenses, so that should be fine. Uh, if we go have a look at the Agrippina sector... Um, one turn here, Necrons. This is a little bit more worrying. But we can get a battleship. Well, oh, we can't afford a battleship. I remember the problem now. We could get the Avenger then. Or we could get, for that amount of points, two light cruisers. And that's one of the things that comes up, by the way, that light cruisers do have a decent amount of firepower for their point value, generally. Personally, my rule of thumb is I still prefer this sort of area, the cruiser, maybe battle cruiser. Definitely Garen cruiser when you consider the Avenger. Uh, I will probably want to grab the Avenger. The other choice is going Vengeance for the plasma weapons. Having the range against Tyranids is going to be very important coming up. I'm very tempted to go for the Avenger just based on that. You know what? Let's go for the Vengeance. Just for variety. And you are going to be unyielding Mr. Grey. And we'll also make this a flagship because it's slightly further away in the fight. Right, bring you over here. Uh, you could get in some more firestorms. Like, again, I'd prefer not to have more firestorms. We've already got four. But the issue we face here is I would have to chuck other ships. We could do that. We have enough points that we don't really care about, like, chucking a ship here or there. I want to get you an Art Mechanicus because I really like Kalan, so I want to put him in a big tanky ship. But mm, 
we could just spam two fire storms for now. They'll probably get killed relatively quickly. I guess if we killed one, we could get a light cruiser. But I really want the Nova Cannons, because Nova Cannon spam is just so good. To get a Nova Cannon, we'd have to kill the light cruiser. And an escort. For now, we'll just get the escorts. Uh, and we want two of them, so we'll grab them at Dentor. And we'll go for five storms or swords. Um, what's your range? Still 9,000. We'll go Firestorm still, I think. Oh, we'll get two swords, why not? The reason being is Tyranids. Uh, I'm not sure what their armor is, I'm pretty sure it's low. So, lance weapons that ignore armor are less useful. Avenger of Fawcett. And... Sandman's Fortitude. Okay. That should put us on a just about more points than them considering the defense platforms. Defense platforms which I've traditionally found are not great against Necrons. Uh, not as bad as Orcs. Orcs just tear through them. Mm, now. Three turns. Four turns. Two turns. I could delay you with mines. Could delay you with mines. Could delay you with mines. Okay. So we've got the ability to delay a lot of stuff there. We are going to need reinforcements though. And this is where the space marine comes in. Which I was hoping not to use you. Because I really want to get rid of you. And get a, a not terrible space marine. I.e. not an ultramarine. Sorry ultramarines. But I, I wanted variety. Yeah. And I cocked up. But I'm going to have to bring you down. Uh, actually, do we need to bring you down? Once we've dealt with that Necron threat, we can probably bring you down to the Agrippina Sector. Yeah, okay, you should actually not head to the Agrippina Sector. Head towards Avoris Gulag in the Nemesis Tessera Sector. Two turns to attack here, four turns to attack here, two turns to attack here. I'm probably going to have to delay this one deliberately so that we can take this fight and then immediately try and jump over to there. Yeah, I'll delay you. I'll make that choice right now. That's not a hard choice to make. I'm actually going to upgrade this because I want to have troop reinforcement regeneration in this sector. Um, because fighting against Tyranids, we're going to need all the troop regeneration we can get. Two turns here. One turn here. Three turn there. The question is, do we do the evacuation? Or do we let this fall to chaos? Hell, there's a good possibility that we could do the counterpunch in here and take this off them. Oh, we need to do that counterpunch for ages. Actually, they're not sending the 900. They're only sending the 500 and the 400. Oh, that fight is totally doable. At the same time, I really want to do Phonosphar. How's Agrippina looking? Any reinforcements that come from Agrippina are probably going to be when we bring the two extra fleets down to here. And then we can get one, two, three. It's going to take a while for any reinforcements to get out there. I think you have to fight alone. If you're fighting alone, that's probably going to mean we can't do this attack. I 
I think we have to just accept the fact that we're going to lose this planet. It's a shame because, you know, repair rate plus 30%, troop regeneration plus 4 is good. Yeah, I think we have to go to this mission. Unknown Tyranid Armada. Okay. That's not worrying. Let's do it. There's a holy relic to protect and a cardinal who has it. The Tyranids, the great devourer. In all the stars, there has never been a Xenos race more inimical to the survival of mankind. Indeed, they are the bane of all other life. Their origins are but poorly understood. The stuff of rumor and supposition and nightmare. The adepts of Mars believe that a single unknowable consciousness guides the high fleets about their voracious purpose. This consciousness knows only unquenchable hunger. Hive ships serve as synapse nodes, spreading the influence of the Tyranid hive mind across the stars. Such is the hive mind's suffocating will that the warp is distorted for light years around. Confusion and terror spread before the hive fleets advance as dreams darken and madness spreads. As the High Fleets advance, the suffocating embrace quenches the Emperor's light and drowns doomed worlds in psychic shadow. But the greatest threat comes from within. Foul creatures known as gene stealers infiltrate unvigilant worlds. A patriarch arises from the population's subverted flesh and projects a psychic beacon to draw the hive fleet ever closer. As the gene stealer cult grows in power, they emerge from the shadows of their benighted world. Civil war rages, shaking the planet asunder. Then the skies darken with spores and the high fleet's voracious tendrils. The cultists exult at the fulfillment of prophecy and their ascension into the light. Their delusions die with them. There are many high fleets, each but a facet of the immeasurable Tyranid threat. Leviathan is the greatest and has wrought ruin on a scale never before witnessed. Though the great rift arising from Cadia's ruin has severed many of Leviathan's tendrils, many more remain. Even now, one is surging towards the Eye of Terror. Okay. Yeah, Tyranids have this whole psychic control thing going on, which is so powerful it also causes problems in the warp for travel and navigation in the air around it. Also in the air in front of it. It's a big problem. Lord High Admiral Spire, do I trust that the incoming ships are under your command? You may, Cardinal. The fleet stands ready to assist in any way that we can. We'll take you aboard after the attack passes. Good. Our sentry craft have reported skirmishes with Tyranid vessels. I hope you have a plan for our salvation. Have faith, Cardinal. Between your prayers and our guns, 
We shall see these monstrosities cast back into death's icy void. We had better. Defend the space station. Destroy every tyranny. Okay. Um, there is a forwards direction on this. Right. Spire, you're number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. And then you're six. I'm actually going to face you off this way because I think we're going to get surrounded. And then six can come back here with the escorts. Ah, you're facing the wrong way. Okay. We're going to go for maximum range on you. Which is 18. Actually, a damn good battleship to have against Tyranids. Unfortunately for the Fury of Sean, that's only nine. You're nine as well. You're nine as well. You're nine, and you're nine. And if you can't run silent, you'll want to be on lock on. No sign of the enemy yet. A lot of sounds. Oh. Tell a lie. Two enemies there. Can't see any enemies over here. Right. Send the escorts. And send some fighters. I'll just send some fighters over here, just in case this is like the same as last time where they did a pincer. Fury interceptors in flight. Ah, it's their fighter craft. Such horrors to think that the galaxy teems with these creatures. They are punishment for our sins. Punishment, I tell you. Then we shall drown them with righteous fire. Such has always been our chastisement for the sinful, has it not? The same should hold true for the sins themselves. Main guns report ready, High Admiral. Then let us give the good Cardinal a modicum of solace. All batteries, open fire! Boarding expertise. Synaptic control. Acid weapons. Launch bays. Bio torpedoes and deadly troop efficiency. Very well. We wait your command. For the Emperor! Aye, Admiral. I'm gonna hold on here. Like, we could use the Nova cannons, but I feel we need to save them. I'm gonna plasma. Oh, damn, that was a bad time to plasma bomb. Drifting Hulk. We wait your command. Okay, let's actually move you closer. That way we can teleport Course back. Engaged. Ah, you brought escorts. Aye, right, the perfect time to use another cannon then. One... Two. Good start. Also, they're destroying that. No, I was going to try and reboard you. I guess you don't want to be reboarded. That's fine. And they're coming from the other direction. They are doing a pincer. Brace out. Yep, they're coming from all directions, actually. But at least you took one out, right? That's that's helpful. Uh, turn around, please. You're gonna have to Nova Cannon again. 
Also, send bombers against that because they have no turrets. Starhawks loaded and sent. Your orders. Right, go. Enemy vessel. Initiate emergency repairs. Starhawks loaded and sent. Get out of there. Cruising speed set. Engaging target. You avoid getting rammed. Come on, you're almost damaged. You can die, please. Five HP, three HP. One HP dead. Excellent. Where are my escorts? I need one escort over here and one escort over here. Course engaged. Your orders? No, no, don't ram me. Ow. Oh, we're losing so many troops on the battleship. This is what I was afraid of. Crippled the enemy. And they've got more coming. Ah! Right. You ready with those Nova cannons? Yes. We wait your command. Meanwhile, over here. You tongued me again. Damn it. Ah, failed to hit anything with that. Okay, send the bombers against you. Now we use our... We must evacuate. I am... I mean, the relic is too important to be lost. Hold to your courage, Cardinal. We will find triumph together. Come on. Apart, the Devourer will feast on our bones. Bam! We cannot hold out. We can and we will. The Emperor stands with us, does he not? He... He does. Very well. We shall hold position. But you had better not fail. Okay, okay. Yep. Whatever you say, mate. This dude here is being particularly annoying. Just sitting right next to the station. We are getting our front cannon shots on it, though. Which is something. We wait your command. I think what we might do is just micro warp jump. Yeah, you can't chase me anymore. Bye. Boom! Your orders? Uh, we're gonna do a call to arms. We need the troops. Ship you ready. need to escape from that. It's gonna ram you. Maximum burn. And you got pulled. Damage team, begin repairs now. Aye, Admiral. Hello. Oi. Execute high energy turn. Engaging. Ship ready. Oh, hello. That exploded horribly. For the Emperor. And they've got another one coming in here. Quick, do a ping. A light cruiser. And more over here. Okay, do we have any more Nova Cannon shots? We do. Nope, cannons there. Plasma cannon there. Bombers over on that one. Starhawks loaded and sent. And I think we'll also Empress Taro. You. Not that really matters. Bam! Bam! Yeah! Okay, now just go to normal fighting skills. Ow. 
Ow. We got rammed again. Ow. Sod it. Brace for impact. I won't shoot that one. There we go. That's dead. Right. You. Alright, kill that one. Feral Instinct. Excellent. Right. That means that the Synapse creature has died. Ow! And they just bumped into each other. Good job there. There's one over here as well. Just keep bracing for impact, that's all we can do. We wait your command. Feral instinct. You focus on this one. Swarm is vanquished. Indeed, Cardinal. <sighs> my thanks for your assistance. Yes, yes, well, I see that thanks to my leadership, the Xenos have been destroyed. I see no reason to delay my departure any longer. Our aid was given gladly, Cardinal. Navigator, we'll depart as soon as the Cardinal and the Relic are aboard. As you command, Lord High Admiral. Damn. That this is this marks the point where hull damage isn't as bad as the sheer amount of damage they've done to our troop value. Yeah, we need to have higher troop value regeneration. It will please you to note that Cardinal Sternhull is safe and full of voice. Already complaining, is he? It would be inappropriate to answer that question. My thanks for your service. Oh, we got an upgrade point for it. Nice. Arm piercing ammunition. At short range, the armor of the target is reduced to 50 against macro weapons. That's really good if we go against Chaos, not against Tyranids. Mm, anything. I think we will go for that. Yeah. Oh, we've got it already. Derp, derp, derp. Okay, um... I'd love to get this. We don't have the thing, though. Let's a quick look in the Medusa sector. It might be worth holding on to it. Unlocks chapter relics upgrade. Critical assault chance ten percent. Okay, that's all the way down here though. We'll move this way because that would get reinforced armor. So we'll actually go for this. Then we can get additional turrets and then reinforced armor. Additional turrets is fine. It's it's a pretty boring upgrade, but it is fine. It it does the job we need it to do. Right. Okay, let's end the turn. We're losing a planet there. And then the next turn, Tyranids hit us. Right. Hi. They outpoint us by two points. Eek. Okay. That's fine. This is fine. We don't have space rings either, which is my normal tactic against Necrons. And we need to come out of this in a state to be able to fight Tyranids. This is fine.
Luckily, we have a couple of nerf cannons. Which is why I'm leading with the Mechanicus. So... Uh, one, two, three, four. And of course that minimizes that. Five. Six. Okay. It's not capture the uh, points, it's not a conquest, which is a shame. I was really hoping it would be. So instead, we're taking a fight around... Wait, did I not get the... Did I not get the space station upgrade? I swore I got the space station upgrade. Did I not? I could have sworn I got a space station. Let me just check this real quick. Load save game. End round auto save. That's an interesting bug. I cannot see my cursor. There we go. Yeah. There is a space station here. Let's end the round again and see if that happens. Ah! It was a fight in Alberton. Right, not the fight. Okay, yeah, right. Completely different battle. My bad. Uh, okay, let's, let's do it. Wait, did the point value change of their fleet? I think the point value of their fleet just went up. Admittedly only by four points instead of two or something, but I think it changed. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, okay, well, it's Conquest now. Whoops. That's my fault. I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll with it anyway, just because I can't bother to go back again. But I do feel bad that I may have just re-rolled into a slightly easier fight. Right, you're gonna be five, and you're gonna be six. That said, you really shouldn't be able to do that in a game. It should be preceded rather than randomly generating each time. That way you can't just save scum to win. You end up with the same fight every time. Uh, we're gonna go up here, grab this point. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. Gee, just everyone range nine. And then, probably lock on. Doing damage against the Necrons is... Oh, hello. Well, this is going to be interesting. Ah, they've got a battleship. They have a tomb ship. Interesting. Interceptors engaging. Wait, are they capturing? No, we're capturing it still. I was just wondering if it was the plasma creatures actually capturing that for us. We're going to have to group up uh, to avoid the plasma creatures doing their weird plasma creature thing. But we can spirit definitely use them. Machine spirit appeased. Now, our Nova Cannon ships are going to want positioned here. Rouse the engines. And you two up here. Thruster 
We are ready to serve. Yeah, I realize I really damaged our space stations by doing that. At the same time, these space stations should be out of the fight. You know what? Let's burn them hard. Weapons calibrated. Engaging drive. To serve Go back to normal. Desire. Where are they headed? Here. Interceptors engaging. We are ready to serve. There the we go. Just spam that full of fighters. Area. Receiving your order. You'll only be able to come back at us, so I don't really want that to happen. These are the swords. Swords have forward firing guns, don't they? Yeah. To serve the Omnisire. State your order. Alright, keep going. Calculating vectors. Oh, good damage there. Can I take advantage of that in any way? Can I follow up with like a Nova Cannon shot? Nova Cannon shot. Nova Cannon shot. That looks good. Two ships, the light cruisers lived. Okay. They managed to swing out of it. The AI is getting pretty good at dodging there. I'm actually going to get you to come closer down here because it looks like they're going to capture this. And if you go the right way, we might get lucky. In fact, let's boost. Might be able to get Red Tempest. Machine spirit appeased. Receiving your order. Nah, you're going the wrong way. We are ready to serve. The spirits obey. There we go. Reaching nominal speed. Rad Tempest. Nova Cannons. The enemy has seized a strategic area. You have seized a strategic area. Deck damage through the shield. Ugh. Killed a load of jackals. Light cruiser. Nice. Messiah, heal thy wounded servant. You right. have accumulated 25% of strategic points. Something else blew up. A scythe class cruiser? Nice! Good job there. State your order. Rouse the engines. Ah, that's the tomb, uh, tomb ship coming in. To serve the Omnissiah. Hostile signature detected. Receiving your order. Okay. Disruption bomb to get rid of the shield. And I want to cancel that order. There we go. Don't want to move everyone over there. Right. I'm going to focus on that tomb ship now. Revere the Omnissiah. Energize vector thrust. Right, fighters. Interceptors engaging. Fighters. Machine spirit appeased. And then Nova Cannon shot. Nova Cannon shot. We are ready to serve. 
Now, the disruption thingy normally shuts down shields, but in this time, it will actually shut down the cauterization effect on your hull, which actually regenerates your hull. Fleeing! Wow, that was quick. State your order. There's a cruiser or battle cruiser, I'm not sure which, coming there. The light cruiser here. Gonna mark you. You know what? We just might teleport to you. Initiate emergency repairs. Keep that pressure up. Like, this is a proper tomb ship. There's nothing to be sneezed about here. It's their battleship. And we've basically used a, a spam Nova Cannon to win. Along with Rad Tempest. Which is what I really love about Mechanicus. The Rad Tempest is awesome. That and Nova Cannon. Everything else I don't really fancy about them. But those two, those two are good. It's just a cruiser over there, which helps. I'm going to send fighters to scout. Like, this is the work of an entire fleet here trying to kill you. Or disruption bomb for you. Yep, I think that's a kill. Nice. The right, deck damaged. We've got a light cruiser here, I didn't see. You know what? Sod it, have a red tempest. Engaging drive. Target on screens. You're the one I boarded before. Ah, right. Taking so much damage in there. Now my hope is that we can get this to wander towards you, but it looks like it's wandering towards us. Which is not the way I was hoping this would go. Right, fleeing. Calculating vectors. That's what I wanted. Shoot it. Boom. That's how it's done. Damage team, begin repairs now. Battle protocols engaged. There we go. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. And now another Necron fight that I completely forgot about. Well, that was the one I forgot about. Now, we didn't win that due to the point like protection thing. We used that we won that basically due to the fact that we spammed a lot of air effect abilities. So rerolling didn't really help us there. They win. Uh really? Fine. And there we go. Now we have the platforms and stuff. Launch battle. Less useful abilities this time around. But we do the Art Mechanicus. Oh, yeah. Look at that rear. Right. We'll want to take the fight around here, no question. 
The gas cloud here is going to be incredibly frustrating. They're going to put escorts in that. Um, right, let's start over here. One, two, three. That's three Nova Cannons. Four, five, six. One, two, three. Four, five, and then put six here. And also nine range. Right. Optimal course set. I'm going to just launch fighters here. That way, if they're going for the fleet, we should intercept them. Receiving your order. We are ready to serve. Furious Dracon. Machine spirit appeased. Ah, nope. Some fighters are coming past us. Ah, we got him. Alright, good job. Hostile signature detected. Right, we do a stasis bomb. Orga probe, orga probe into that cloud. Disruption bomb. We can use these. We've got double stasis bomb as well with these fleets, so. I guess we just spam that. And then Nova Cannon. Right, so get here with your Nova Cannon. That's a weird... Right, you go here. You go here. I don't know why you were doing, like, a crossover. You two come up to here. And I want you here. I'm actually have you boost as well. Right, that is a... Cruiser, battle cruiser, light cruiser. Not sure what that is. Judging by how far it's behind, I'm thinking maybe a tomb ship. So full-on battleship. Machine spirit appeased. Let's go have a look. Oh, that was organ disruption, not uh, shield disruption, however. Okay. Well, makes it harder for us to see. Well, other way around. Sorry, makes it harder for them to see us. Hostile signature detected. Battle cruiser. Hostile signature detected. Okay. Very well. Receiving your order. Transition begun. Let's start off with a stasis bomb. I am. Hostile signature detected. Yep, you definitely need to your stop orders? accelerating. Engaging. Right. To serve the Omnisire. Might stay this bomb here or something, but for now I think we'll leave it. Right, Nova Cannons, get ready. Take much more. I want to put a Nova Cannon here just to wipe these out, and then two up here on you. Nice. Okay, you are pretty hurt, actually. I'm going to bring you about. And then we'll board you. What is this? Another battle cruiser. Okay. Send out fighters at this battle cruiser. Interceptors in flight. Your orders. How long till the Nova Cannons? A little while. We're gonna stasis bomb up here. We serve. And actually, we'll pull back towards the de defense uh, platforms for safety. We serve. 
You're pretty badly damaged. I'm actually going to pull you out of this fight. Our navigator will guide us out. State your order. Send fighters at you. Interceptors engaging. We wait your command. Brace for impact. No! Generate damage. Damn it. Okay, get over here. Receiving your order. Oh, come on. Stasis field hold. You're going to get out. Nah. Bam, bam, bam. Good. Nice shooting. Uh, you managed to get the battle plans back. Stasis bomb. Just going to spam a lot of stasis bombs here if you hadn't guessed. Ship ready. Ah. Right. Uh, you have now permanently damage generator. You can't actually escape. Changing course. We are ready to serve. All ahead full. Targeting enemy vessel. Heading acknowledged. Okay. Underway. Hi there, light cruiser. Boink. Spirit appeased. That should destroy you. I hope that's a kill. Does not compute. Doesn't look like it. Right. I think we'll pull you out. You're pretty badly damaged. But we will ping with you because I want to see. Ah, it's still alive! Kill it! Kill it before it can regenerate! Your orders? Alright, run silent. Kill it! Okay, we've got a lunar class coming in here. Coordinates acknowledged. Yes, killed it. Nice. Machine spirit appeased. Okay, no more Nova Cannon shots, so let's turn and fight normally. Interceptors engaging. It's a light cruiser. We are ready to serve. Right, fireboard ship, let's put that out. I'm actually gonna jump you. We could jump you, you're pretty badly damaged. Yeah, we'll jump you out. You have drawn the lucky straw. Brace for impact. Warp drive approaching full function. Target on screens. And then battleship boarding, which should be pretty powerful. Make sure we take out your weaponry. Legio Cybernetica have boarded the enemy. Hmm. Not as good as I thought it would be. Right, bombers take out that. Engine damaged. We're gonna stasis bomb you because we can. 
Star Hawks engaging. Okay, come on. You little green necroni. And come on, get the kill. There we go, right. Now you. What's this? Another light cruiser. They're just a million of you guys, isn't there? Maybe you want to just split up a little bit. Ship ready. Target locked in. Star Hawks engaging. Right. Keep going. State your order. Fleeing. Dead. Right, you. Let's go for close range this time. Teleportarium vectors calculated. Everyone lock on. Just go for sheer damage. Hi there. Boom! That's the win. Okay, making headway. The problem is the Tyranid's coming. And got a battle plan, which is going to be very useful in slowing down Tyranids. A bit of damage you have to put up with, but nothing major. Yes, attack each other. Great. Ah, mines. All right, that's three turns until you. That's frustrating because that's actually quite a big force. Uh... Mechanicus are terrible at boarding. So Mechanicus is going to go sit here and defend against that. You're going to head to Agrippina. What we'll do for you is you will actually pull away from this planet for one turn. And we will give you extra ships. This is the listening post. I actually want to upgrade this because it gives us more battle plans. Um, yeah, I think that's the way we have to go here. Meanwhile, in Agrippina, One turn here, two turns here. Let's get you in position. Ah, I hate the fact we've got a lot of mechanical stuff here. It's not going to help. Get defense platforms up. One turn here. So badly damaged. We're actually gonna maybe lose this battle. Oh, uh, we're gonna need everything we can get. Oh dear, let's let's get a firestorm. Oh, a sword, a sword, yeah, a sword. This is gonna go poorly. Uh. This is the dauntless melody. That should work quite nicely. 
in Nemesis Tessera. One turn there, two turn there, three turn there. Okay, you get defense platforms as well. My main concern here is that there's no decent shipyards here to repair you. Any damage you take will be lasting. And oh yeah, orcs in one turn as well. Just in case you forgot that. I'm debating what to do with you. Definitely move you to here. And then we could buy you a fleet. Or we could just not. Two turns until never a of the I might have to run ultramarines. Ugh. If we were to send you in, one, two, you couldn't get into the fray anyway. If I were going to send you extra ships... Probably should buy your battle barge now. Also, look at that. One of the most expensive ships, possibly the most expensive ship in the game. Two plasma heavy macro. Lance turrets, three. Heavy lance artillery, two. Good range on those. Three launch bays. Six torpedoes, three launch bays. Three bombardment cannon, two heavy macro. Bombardment's about shorter range. I think we'd want to go with that for the range increase. I think we need to. I really wish I hadn't picked an ultramarine. But we need you. Right. 93 points left. That doesn't leave much. Uh, okay. We can have a Gladius. And this is going to be... Knave of Sponges. Knaves Pride. Chosen of Brian. Look at that sexy battleship. Oh, yeah. Right. send you in. Um, yeah, we probably want you there. That way, if we do lose this battle, we could send you in to help. I take it back. And if we do win this battle, uh, we can always send you up here to be able to react. Okay. I'll get the minor shipyard here for the, the healing and stuff. Um, shipyard here as well. Going to keep the rest because we might well need to buy a lot more ships next turn. Got a feeling this is going to be a bit messy. Oh, actually, no, I will get this listening post. Because I want battle plans. Delaying enemies is going to be very, very handy. Right. I think this is where we end the episode. Long episode today. But the preparation for the tyranny is needed to be done. I've been at releasing. I hope you enjoyed. If you have, like, you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. But until next time, when it's going to be a lot of tyranids and one fleet of orcs, stay shiny.